How to get rid of ants in your car in simple steps. A few bugs and ants in your car should not bother you, especially in summer. Insects tend to be many when the weather is warm or hot. However, it becomes a concern when ants increase until they seem to be everywhere in your car. So, how do you get rid of ants in your car? There are several steps to get rid of ants from your car and stop them from returning. This video explains the steps and what to use in simple steps. But first, what are the tools and materials you'll need to complete this task? For the full list and where to get them, check the description and pinned comment below. Now that you have all your tools and materials ready, let's get rid of those pesky ants. Get rid of it! General steps to get rid of ants in your car. Determining the type of ant infesting your car is crucial before selecting an elimination method. However, as true as this fact is, you can get rid of most ants using the same techniques and steps. The difference is usually in the prevention steps. You must know what attracts to prevent a future infestation. Step 1. Search your car. Before applying any substance to remove ants from your car, it helps to run a thorough search. You can call it detailing your car, and that entails looking in every nook and cranny. No space, crack, or hole is too small to search as long as it can hold things that attract ants. Look under the seats, floor mats, inside the glove compartment, under the hood, look everywhere. Remove old bottles, paper bags, and empty containers and throw out anything that may attract them. Do the same in your boot before vacuuming the entire car as much as possible. Also, scrub stubborn stains and sticky surfaces because ants typically gather where there are food crumbs. In addition, check the tires and the areas surrounding them. Food particles and debris may stick to them, causing ants to invade your car through the tiniest openings. Step 2. Find the nest. Getting rid of the ants in your car only works if you can find the nests. The nests are their breeding grounds and where they live. So, you must find them to get rid of them completely from your car. Your search is incomplete without destroying the nests. Therefore, try as much as possible to find the nests. There may be one or more, but when you find them, destroy them. You can use hot water to get them out of your car, but that depends on the location. Alternatively, use diatomaceous earth or boric acid. Spread the powder at the entrance to these nests to dry up the ants and kill them. Step 3. Use a simple solution. A simple mixture of any citrus dish soap, salt, and water will work in reducing the ant population in your car and around it. So, mix one tablespoon of citrus dish soap, one tablespoon of salt, and two cups of water in a spray bottle. Shake the mixture well to ensure that the salt dissolves. Spray it on the ants where they gather the most. Ants typically hate citrus, so it is the perfect solution to the problem. You can also clean the car with the mixture to spread the scent of citrus everywhere. It will keep the ants away, and if you missed some in the car, it will kill them. Step 4. Park somewhere else. This may not be a permanent arrangement, but consider parking your car at another spot for some time. It may be inconvenient, but if you successfully get rid of the nests, it may help to remove their breeding ground and throw them off for a while. Keep your car some distance away from the old spot until you are sure it is free of all ants and other insects. Step 5. Use professional assistance. It is not every time that cleaning, sanitizing, and using a homemade solution work in getting rid of ants in your car. Sometimes, a few ants remain, which is enough to start another infestation. However, if you have a challenge getting rid of the ants, consider calling a professional exterminator. They are in the best position to determine the source and cause of the ants before getting rid of them for good. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you liked it and found it useful. If so, please like, share, and comment to let me know what you thought. Your feedback is important to me. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos.